Welcome back to the Fairy Tales and Cocktails show. My name is Nilsa. I am your host and psychic medium for the channel. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to say, welcome back to my channel. Anyway, this is a quick full moon check-in for the collective energies. I'm using my pink card to match my shirt because why not? Anyway, um... I've done some spreads yesterday and got a bunch of um, inner child healing in different decks. Like, I'm not saying, oh, they're all going through that part of it, but it's, yeah. Okay, so we got Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Swords. This is fresh energy, like fresh perspectives. And I love this. This cat has a pentacle in the center of the forehead, which is like um, third eye activation that they were all going through. Excuse me, see even my words are scattered right now, like prickly. The devil energy, nine of pentacles. So, and nine of swords. I was just about to say nines are like the angel number 999 is the number of completion, right? So we have the devil 99. So this feels like the energy of greed, I, I guess you can say, is cycling out. I feel like they're learning a lot about themselves too, like where are all the decisions that they have and biases coming from? But it, it's happening. I mean, we all knew it was going to happen so fast. Nine of Cups, really fast energy. We all knew. It's kind of like, you know, sometimes we say, buckle up, sweetheart, buckle up. That's why. Now we have King of Wands. Getting into King energy. Queen of Cups. We have fire and water. I feel that um, page of wands, queen of wands now. I feel the, I'm hearing the words catch up, like they're playing catch up with, so like the king of wands is matching the queen of wands because your, um, and it's like your love healed them, that sounds so cliche, but it's catching up. So it's like they're going through a lot of pain really quickly, but they're also alchemizing it just as quickly with all like the love that you gave them ahead of time. And we also have Page of Wands here. This is like swish and flick, new beginning coming through. I'm gonna check this other deck. Three of Cups celebrations. Um, a lot of, and I'm talking about a lot of, Feminines have been messaging me regarding um, baby dreams, phantom baby kicking, phantom, um, like audible, audible, not hallucinations, but what's the word? Like you think you hear a baby cooing and there's like nobody there. Um, and that has a lot to do with that page of wands, ace of wands energy, like that new, brand new rebirth, okay? So we've got um, travel and commitment. I do feel like they are making plans. This is like, I'm ready to go the distance. I'm hearing like that Hercules song. I can go the distance, I'll be on my way. I don't know the words, so let's just go with that. Ha, look at this. Um, new beginnings, as I was saying beginning communicate ready I'm pumped I'm ready to go I sing a lot if you don't like it change the channel okay my friends love it that's all that matters my friends are loyal <laughs> so we've got test divine masculine meditate unknown so but I feel like before they didn't know what the hell you were talking about or what the name was or what they were even doing they didn't even know they were like dream walking they didn't even know they were manifesting it was like done i don't want to say by default but it comes so natural 
they didn't even know it, it's like kind of um when divine feminine start their journey and they're googling everything what's happening right so we know that there's a name to it but i feel like they didn't that's this is what the unknown is in the meditation they didn't know they were traveling to the 5d and all this they thought they were just daydreaming and fantasizing no 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 they were testing it they've been testing um the signs so if they go mute for like a few days or whatever and then you start seeing random they're not random but aligned signs and stuff it's because they're testing it to see if they can send you stuff if they can say things to you so we've got fragile what's fragile talk to me here talk to me fragile pep preparation let go silence action mm -hmm. i feel like there's a lot of a lot of i don't want to use the word moving parts i just feel that they know everything that you're saying to each other is you guys repeat it and i know this and i hear this from other feminines and masculines they'll repeat everything the other person has last said to them and they kind of take it as gospel even though that was just the energy they were feeling if they were feeling four of swords energy and they're like i don't want to talk to you for a while you can't hold that against them if today they woke up in chariot energy you don't know that because you keep repeating and dwelling in the old energy so be very careful with that that's very fragile and that's um what this card alone is meaning then we have preparation and let go silence and action oh i just said chariot energy that's funny and silence four swords and chariot energy this is exactly those two cards as i was saying uh preparation and let go so they're preparing to let go of what they were holding on to as far as excuses i'm hearing like oh my job is over here or uh i don't know all the all these fake <sighs> chains i'm hearing fake chains surrender yeah let go and surrender this isn't for you baby girl you did your work so if this is resonating it's because look F divine feminine you did your work you surrendered babes one and done you surrendered you went the distance fantasy with this castle look at this beautiful castle i love it moon cycles rebirth this is this is the first thing i said i was like <sighs> rebirthing new perspectives moon cycles it's like right now right now why oh why do we build castles in the sky is what i'm hearing this is like i don't know if you can probably see it or not it's like why are they castles in the sky <laughs> uh, i like this deck i was gonna say something to you because i know um i have different people i have different people that watch me on here versus my um i have a morning show called throne talks that i do uh, on my Instagram channel. If you're not following me now, you should do it. No time like the present because there's what? lots of messages that come through. I can go the distance. This is going to be your new jam for like tomorrow. I want all of you watching to put this song on tomorrow. It's Hercules. Michael Bolton, I can go the distance. Wow, traveling to your house. Look at that. Building you a little birdhouse. I don't care. <laughs> Okay, so as I was saying, my Instagram is Fairy Tales and Cocktails Tarot. But you, I think you can probably just look up like the hashtag Throne Talks. And um, yeah, it's different signs. I mean, not signs, messages. Sorry, I'm like reading the cards. This <laughs> We've got signs, miracles, and lessons. A feather, we have a feather, a dandelion, and books. Um. I'm feeling this library is really uh, standing out to me because of Beauty and the Beast. You know why? <sighs> if you watch Beauty and the Beast, you know the scene where she goes to get a book and he's like, that one? But you've read it twice or seven times already. And she's like, I know, but it's my favorite, right? So you might be repeating the same songs, reading the same books, but... 
feel like there's, if you're fe being guided to go reread a book, if you're being guided to go re-listen to a song or watch a movie again, it's because you have that rebirth of fresh eyes, fresh perspective, and there's going to be a sign in there for you. From I'm getting your higher self as well. You are the flower coming through the cement here. You are the miracle. You are. Um, your healing is the miracle. Not everybody does it. Not everybody's as strong. There's a lot that either some succumb to just old soulmate soulmate contracts or you know like suicide. Like it's it's not. It takes all of you so far. Like look in the mirror and say, I am the strongest woman in the world. Because for all you know, you are you are the strongest woman in the world. We have third dimension navigate. This 3D card has been coming out a lot lately, a lot. And it's because there's so many unions coming forward in the 3D. But what's coming, this compass, um, like I was saying, for my, my fairy family that tunes in every morning knows the compass is always coming through in different decks. The compass and clocks have been coming through. Like um, tick tock, ready or not, here I come, you can't hide. But this third dimension, these buildings are what's um, sticking out to me. One of you um, could be thinking about going to a city. We have mystery came out reverse and wish came out. Mystery came out reverse and wish. So I feel like that's what's, hold on, I'm trying to get comfortable. I feel like what this is saying is you are manifesting, it's not a wish. You know what's coming next, it's not a mystery. It's not a mystery, so if you were like, oh, I wanna go to, I don't know, San Antonio. I wanna go to SeaWorld San Antonio. And then you guys end up going, it's not, don't be like, oh, of all places. Babe, you, you manifested that, relax. Anyway, so back to what you can expect tonight. I feel like a lot of you have been eating a lot of salty foods. Uh, you're low in iron. Some of you have been having weird flare-ups from dietary. That's what I keep hearing, both feminine and masculine, because you're starting to kind of feel their sensi food sensitivities. It's coming through food sensitivities, skin sensitivities. So if you were never allergic to soap and all of a certain soap and all of a sudden you're getting a weird rash and you're like, what's happening? It's because they react like that. It's, it, that's what part of it coming into the three dimension. The skyline is like the horizon is, you know, you see the buildings going up and down, up and down. Now they're starting to level out. Separation ending, I told you, like this. Oh, and look, a balloon. I have a balloon. <laughs> I get all excited, the balloons. I have a balloon. I have a Mickey Mouse balloon. It's pink. Okay. Uh, the signs, yeah. The separation's ending. It's on the bottom of the deck. I don't even want to keep pulling anymore because you, how do you even get any better than that? Separation, ending, union. <laughs> like, I'm so happy for all of you. Starting your missions. Yeah, so very strong energy tonight. Very strong. Let's see if we have any more. Oh, okay. Four of Swords, which I called earlier about um, the energy they've been in. Four of Swords. The Magician, King of Swords, and Page of Swords. Reevaluating how to um, say what they want to say friendly. And I feel like this is for you. This is for you right now because this is, I mean, most of the, this whole deck is, is women, but look at her body language. Okay. She has her arms crossed. So, and I'm telling you to go gentle. I am telling you, please, please, please go gentle for your own sakes. So, okay. Instead of being like this, mm -hmm, I told you so. I know. Which, I mean, we've all had that mistake of saying, yeah, I know. Duh, of course, I told you. And, and that's ego, it really is, like, to be like, why don't, because you feel like, why don't you trust me? I've been trying to warn you or tell you. Uh, like, but anyway, they have to learn on their own, whatever. Um, so they're gonna come through and say it and 
they're really, and this almost looks like my earrings here. Look. <laughs> so I've had to, and part of that four of swords is giving you time. God is giving you time to calm down, recompose yourself and be like, okay, how do I say this nicely? How do I say this nicely? Okay, Just listen and, and then do this cute face that I do like, uh-huh. Oh, really? Oh, huh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you don't have to listen to me. This is for entertainment purposes only, right? Um, but they, there's this song I love by Rufus Dussault. And I think it's called You Were Right. He goes, you were right. I just can't get enough of you. But I mean, what woman, what woman doesn't like hearing that they're right, especially when you're a high priestess, divine feminine. But I mean, you can't get mad either because it's almost like they awakened your gifts so you can't look a gift horse in the mouth. But that's all. This is like getting to be a long video. I'm sorry, you rent up 15 minutes. So, <sighs> sorry, I'm try trying to bring back that gentle energy again. I got riled up. See, it, peak, it comes back. Sometimes you get triggered. Old things trigger you. For me, my biggest trigger is when people don't listen to me. When they put words in my mouth or when they don't listen to me and then like take credit for something I told them about. But I'll admit it. It's something I work on. If you would like a personal reading to find out what's going on with your situation chip, my information's in the description box below. You just email Fairy Tales and Cocktails Tarot. If you want to... Join the fairy family and subscribe. Hit the notification bell and make sure it's all dark gray. And that's going to like be like, beep, 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 and let you know when I have a new message for you. It might be urgent, might not. One way to find out, right? Also, I love you more than ice cream. And I will see you real soon.